I'm kind of curious to see what's inside this bag. I think I might take a peek. Yeah, oh. What's going on everybody? Nick from 618 Fishing here and today I'm heading out to a small creek that is nearby to hopefully catch some fish. Okay guys, just got down here and it actually looks pretty promising. I'm going to try out this little pool right here. There's a little bit of a current and uh, some slack water right in there and I think it's actually pretty deep so I think that's gonna be probably my best chances of catching a fish. So I'm gonna to get to it, guys. Here are my two, uh, my two uh, combos I brought out here. I've got my ultralight, my four and a half foot ultralight that I use mostly for micro fishing. So I'm gonna do some micro fishing. And then I've got my larger spinning combo. It's still light, but it is, uh, I think it's about six, six and a half feet. And uh, I might throw some spoons or, not some spoons, I might throw some spinners on there or something. Maybe uh, catch a fish that way also. So for the micro fishing, I'm once again going to use my go-to bait, which is small pieces of hot dog. And I'm just gonna prepare it out here. I just brought a little piece of hot dog along. It really doesn't take much at all to get a lot of bait. So uh, I'm just gonna cut that into some small pieces and start off with micro fishing, see if there's anything biting. ground is frozen right here. I'm kind of curious to see what's inside this bag. I think I might take a peek. Yeah, oh, that smells really bad. Man, there's a lot of blood in there, skin. I don't know, just suspicious. That is a, that bag is pretty disgusting though. It looks like the head might have been severed off. I've got no problem with hunting, but I do have problems with people who uh, illegally hunt. Yeah, hi. My name's Nick. Uh, I'm out here fishing at this creek, and I just found a suspicious-looking deer. I'm not sure who to report that to. Okay, I'm sorry. Where where did you find it at? Uh, I'm at this creek, and it's on the bank of the creek. And there's like a bag next to it with some looks like body parts in it, maybe from the deer. Is it underneath the bridge? Or? Uh, no. It's about looks like 30 yards to the east, I believe. No, is it wooded there? Um. No, not really. It's just a rock bank, and there's a couple trees, but it's it's not really wooded. Okay, and you said it's a deer carcass. Yeah, it's a well, it's weird. It's a carcass. The head's missing, and uh, there's a bag with it looks like the hide and some organs in it, maybe. Dumped it out there. I'll uh, um, have them run out there and check it and see what they think. Then, and if they have any questions, they'll give you a call. Okay. All right. Sounds good. Okay. 
I appreciate you calling. Sorry it took me so long to figure out where it was. Oh, it's okay. It's kind of in the middle of nowhere. <laughs> All right. Alrighty, thank you. All right, thank you. Bye. Okay guys, the sun is going down and it's starting to get really chilly, so I think I'm going to call it a day. Didn't catch any fish unfortunately, but uh, still had a fun time out here. It's a cool little fishing spot, even if you're not catching fish, it's uh, just a fun place to hang out for a little bit. As you saw, I did end up reporting that deer carcass, it just looked a little suspicious. It might be legally taken, but uh, I just thought better safe than sorry. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed watching the video, I will catch you on the next one.